Round by round boxing here with Jesse Vargas at the post Bradley Pacquiao press conference. What are your initial thoughts, man? Uh, initial thoughts on the fight, it was an entertaining fight. We tended to see more of a chess match. You know, we thought it was going to be a little more uh, action packed, but um, you know, they were just out thinking one another. And they know, it seemed like they knew each other so well that um, they were stealing each other's moments. You know, that they knew when one, one or the other was going to attack and they were just able to move out the way. Is that the kind of fight you expected to see tonight? I was I was actually expecting an action packed fight with me. I thought they were gonna go at it. You know, it was the third one, the grudge match, and they were gonna prove prove to one another who was the best fighter, which they did, but they didn't. It wasn't as as, uh, as busy as we thought. You know, a lot of people thought that they were gonna be seeing a Tim Bradley 2.0 since you know Teddy Atlas came into the picture. Did you buy into that, or did you feel that he already he wasn't going to change that much with the with the change in training? In the last fight, I, I saw Sam Bradley, and um, you know he's always been fast, uh, consistent with, with his punches and and, and uh, with a lot of experience. You know, he came into this fight, and, and I said before, I said if he's going to show that he did have improvement, he's going to show it in this fight. You know, but he, he lost the first two fights, and he lost this one. So, um, you know, what does that mean? Are you eyeing the winner, or are you eyeing? Bradley again, and or mine, the fight that's possible. You know, the fighter that will fight me. Right. You know, and um, hopefully Manny will, will, will. Manny's an option. You know, um, if he wants to fight for the world title, we'll force him. I'm open for, for that fight. And uh, what's the best way to showing uh, Bradley who I am and what I'm capable of? It's to beating the guy that he could have beat three times. So exactly. I imagine that. You, know. you just came off a big win off of an impressive Saddam Ali. Do you think? People are kind of a little bit more fearful of going in the ring with you after you such know, an impressive run. Definitely, I'm, I'm a different fighter. You know, what I mean, thanks to this man here. You know, doing mm -hmm. Cooper, David Hayes, and, and my entire team. You know, we're uh, looking forward to big things and giving the fans better, better fights, better performances, and uh, more for them. Ultimately, that's what we do. Uh, and a message to your fans waiting to see you fight again. Yeah, thank you for your support. We should be back in the ring sometime in July. So uh, stay tuned, everything's being negotiated now, and uh, we should be, well, follow me on Instagram, Jesse Vargas underscore, and Twitter, Jesse underscore JV. Follow my trainer, Dewey Cooper, Black Cobra. What is it, Black Cobra at? Yeah, DC, Black Cobra. Cobra with a K. Yeah, follow him, man. There you have it, Jesse Vargas. Thanks for the time. Anytime.